Okay, on the last episode, uh, we successfully load the background for the game. Uh, now we need to load the platform. So now we need to place this platform object inside the project folder. So go to the project folder and paste it inside the project folder. Okay, now we need to load the uh, platform inside the uh, screen. So create another variable local uh, platform here platform is available uh, again make the same api call new image rect uh, specify the file name here the file name is uh, platform.png uh, now specify the width and height for the platform here the width is 300 and height is 50 now save the file now relaunch so here now the platform available on the top left corner this is because by default corona plays all the image to the coordinate 0 comma 0 that's why this image appear here so in our game uh, we have to place the platform at the bottom and we have to uh, make sure that there is a little bit space available at the bottom side so uh, we can simply change the x and y coordinate properties of the object uh, so by changing the x and y properties of the object you can move this object anywhere on the screen so platform dot x so here uh, we have to move the uh, object to the center so the x value is the center point so display dot content center x and save it relaunch the simulator so uh, now we place the platform at the center of the screen uh, now we need to move the platform to the bottom that means we have to change the y coordinate so platform dot y equal to display dot here i'm going to make another api called content height and subtract some value from it so here this api return the total height of the content area and here uh, we uh, sub subtract some value from it this is because uh, we need some space uh, below the platform that's why uh, we subtract some uh, unit from the total height of the content area okay now save it now relaunch so here we place the platform at the bottom and there is enough space at the bottom 